Thank you, Mr. Speaker. As we approach the end of the calendar year, I'm proud that both chambers have finally come together to pass the 2014 National Defense Authorization Act. This important bill will help ensure that men and women of our armed services have the resources they need to do their job and keep our country safe. I'm especially pleased that this legislation includes important reforms Forms to help prevent military sexual assault by better protecting whistleblowers and holding perpetrators accountable for their actions. This critical reform is an amendment from legislation introduced by my Republican colleague, Representative Jackie Walorski, and my Democratic colleague, Representative Loretta Sanchez, that passed the House with 110 bipartisan co-sponsors and nearly 50 members of our freshman class. Because of our joint efforts working across the aisle, this is a great first step in furthering protecting heroes in uniform who take the extra heroic step of coming forward to blow the whistle on military sexual crimes. It's been an honor to help build support for this legislation, and I urge my colleagues to continue to work to end sexual violence in our military.